Are you preparing? Well, I start off my day with about 100 to 500 push ups, and I do a set of about a thousand crunches, and I just I just am um, in the mindset, I practice every day, and you know what? I'm gonna come out on top. You guys can get through. Okay. Oh, sorry, Dina. Good civilian. I'm gonna hold up the, uh, the hallway. Oh, you don't hold up hallways? Nah. Um, lots of burpees. Um, been dieting. Uh, only been eating uh, kale and <laughs> ice cream sundaes. Oh. Um, but basically, I'm just trying to get my mind right, uh, get my head in, head in the uh, pageant, and uh, just get ready. What have I been doing to prepare for the Mr. Hiller competition? Well, I work out three hours a day, get my vocal cords massaged two hours a day. And the other hour, you know what I do? I take confidence classes, because I'm confident I will win. And those three things are what breed a Hiller. I don't sleep. I've been practicing my puppets all day. I've been uh, I've been posing at home, and uh, I just don't sleep for some reason. I've just been working really hard to win. How have I been preparing? I've been eating my veggies. I've been going to sleep early. I am ready for this. I am more ready than I'll ever be. So what am I doing to prepare for Mr. Hiller? You know, I've been hitting the weights every day, hitting the swole factory, doing my thing. I've been going to Mr. Brody for some vocal singing. Why do you think you'll win, Mr. Hiller? Well, you see, I'm just the greatest person in the entire world, so why would I not win? All right? What would it mean to you to win, Mr. Hiller? Oh, it'd mean everything. Uh, ever since I was a little kid, all I wanted to do was be Mr. Hiller. It's like I've been working all, all these years and be... I like I would probably like cry like because I've been I've been working so hard for this and uh, my goal is in sight and I just want to go grab it. Why do I want to win Mr. Hiller? For starters, my dad won Mr. Medfield in Medfield when he was in high school and now I would love to fill in his shoes. Also, I feel like I deserve it more than anyone, especially Jeff Mark, Will, and Dan, because um, I'm better than them, and uh, I really want to win. I'm going to win, Mr. Hiller. Look me into the eyes and see a winner. That is what you see, Mr. Hiller, me. What would it mean to you to win Mr. Hiller? Gee golly, it would be the coolest thing in the world. Uh, Jack Feather here. What, what have I been doing to prepare for Mr. Hiller? I've been writing a lot of poetry lately. Uh, here's a little sample I, I wrote. <clears throat> Mr. Hiller, cause I'm a killer. King of the hell, give you that thrill. Vote for me to end world hunger. I'm the epitome of human perfection. I'm the, pit the epitome of a Hiller. I just want this so bad. <laughs> what would it mean to me to win Mr. Hiller? Well, let me tell ya. I'm a born bred Hiller. I go to the Gorm every single morning. I bleed green. It would mean the world to me to be Mr. Hiller. Thank you. Goodbye. What do you mean?